How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games and another episode of The Sims. In the last episode, I was debating whether it was too quick or too soon to get engaged, and you know what? It is too soon. This game takes it way too quickly. I'm going to take it at my own pace, so we will not be getting engaged this quickly. There's plenty more to see or do. Who knows if this is the, you know, the guy for me, you know? <laughs> But so far he's been nothing but nice, there's been no sign of cheating, and he doesn't mind the fact that I want to walk around naked most of the day. But these two are getting on fine, like Big Boobs is, is having a nice time, she's taking care of herself, it's all good. Should Nipples invite over classmate Alexander? Yeah, why not? Oh yeah, he's exhausted. Did you invite your friend over? Oh you did. I did, and I'm answering the door in my underwear. <laughs> Let's make some more friends. I need some more girlfriends in my life. Seems okay. What's her name? Bella. Bella Goth. Okay. Where Goth are you? Well, he's gone to bed because he's just absolutely exhausted. Oh, he's there. He's in his room. That's not weird at all. He doesn't seem very happy, does he? Alright, calm down to cook grilled cheese but she made a friend anyway with uh with Bella Goff that's that's another girl girlfriend we should invite a girlfriend over you know we're always inviting the boyfriend over let's take time to get to know other people shall we there's no rush there's no rush at all is there big boobs but I tell you there really is a rush to, to teach you to get dressed really grilled cheese and sexy underwear a woman after my own heart Okay, so he's going downstairs now because he got invited over and all Nipples did was go to bed. What's he doing? Ah, you've come to talk to me. It's not weird at all. Hey, little boy, I don't, I don't, I've never seen you before. Uh, don't follow me around. It's, it's weird enough. Why did she make a grilled cheese sandwich and just leave it? Oh, hold on. Alexandra Goff. That's the child of the woman I was just speaking to. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, it's not that weird then. Well, it, it kind of is. Well, I guess someone's got to talk to him, right? He was invited over by his friend, and his friend's just pissed off the bed. Maybe, I, you know, I feel awkward. I feel really awkward. I think I should invite her over. Oh, what? She, uh, Pearl, his mum is not in my, my phone book for some reason. Did we not get along? Yeah, laugh it up, big boobs. I swear you've got psychological issues that are... But you know what? You're perfect! So who gives a shit? You're gonna... Oh, there she is! Nah, cancel all that. Alright, we're just... We've cancelled everything. So she becomes our friend. Hey, he looks like nipples, but like a, a kinder version. <laughs> Alexandra Goff. Oh, alright, her son's in my phone book, but not her. How is this possible? Okay, I gotta go. Uh, you should say goodbye, Big Boobs. Now you're just running in the neighbourhood naked. That's fantastic. Big Boobs, for the love of God, will you please get dressed? Raiding around in front of your son with your ass hanging out. You invite Alexander Goff round, and I'll tell you what, I'll invite his mum round. How about that? There we go. And, um... Nipples is coming to see Thingy. Flirty? Why is she in a flirty mood? Nipple, uh, uh, big boobs. <laughs> Hold the phone. All right, I'm just gonna set these two up. I think you need to calm down. Why? Why is she being flirty? What's this? She just asked if she was single. And she's married. What is going on? She just she just became flirty when she came over. I mean, this is this is you know une unexpected. I I don't. But she's with Jay and she's she's straight, right? What are you talking about? Chat with Bella. That's fine. Can chat with Bella. Confess attraction? She doesn't like it, but what are you doing, big boobs? 
Bouchard. Ah. Do something now. Oh my god. Yeah, go go inside and think think straight. What happened there? You can come in, you know. I know you're probably a bit shocked. She's with someone and so is Big Boobs. Oh, for the love of god. You've gone to bed again? Where's your friend? He's down in the garden. <laughs> You've gone to bed. Now he's going to tell. He's going to tell his mum now, Nipples. What are, you, what are you doing in my son's room? Oh, okay. You're going to watch TV. Ask to move in. How can you ask a friend to move in? Look, look! Ask to move in! And she's still flirty. I should really get going. Oh, our son's going home. Maybe you should as well. Like, I just wanted a friendship. And I think she does too. What is nipples? What is big boobs doing? I keep calling her nipples. <laughs> I think like... I think that maybe she is j What was that? What was that? Are they... What? What was that? Sit to get... Were they... I don't... I, I lack the... I lack the ability to understand what's happening. And Nipples is on the bed behind him. <laughs> this is the most inappropriate household ever. Shit. Things just escalated quickly. Tell me you're going to bed alone. Nap. Yes. Take a nap. All right, Bella. You use my son's computer. That's absolutely fine. There's nothing wrong with that at all. Nipples, it's me, Alexander. Do you want to come over and play? Okay. What? Okay, we're going uh, over to his house. So this is the goth household I think uh, Nipples is going to. He went on his own? Well, I guess I'm very friendly with his mother. This is their house? Oh my god, that's that's Bella's husband. <laughs> Sir, you're, you're about to lose your wife if you don't pay attention. That's their daughter. Oh my god. This house is actually pretty cool. <laughs> okay, we're we going in. Let's go play chess together. Okay, so they're going to play chess together in the goth household. This is a cool house. Okay, we're going to go over to Big Boobs. I can't leave her on her own at the moment with what is is going on. <laughs> what, what happened? She answered the door to her when she invited her over just for some girly time. And, and just started being flirty. She's no longer flirty. You know your son's over at her house, right? You know you could destroy a family, right? Big boobs, do you know what you're doing? I could intervene and stop it, couldn't I? But I I'm not going to. She's made these decisions herself, you know? And I want to see where what happens. Funny enough, I'm watching it like you are. <laughs> Just watching it unfold. Hey. Oh, thank you. You're doing my chores for me now as well. That's cool, I guess. They undoubtedly get on very well. I mean, they're getting on pretty well. What was that? What did she do? Have you lost your shit completely? What about Jay? <laughs> what, 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 when, when did this happen? She's gone to bed. Travel to the museum. Well, we can do that, I guess. Nipples is going to bed. Like, everyone keeps going into his room and disturbing him. No, you're not going in there. You know where you're going to go? You know where you're going to go? You are going to go to the museum, my friend. Okay, and you're going to clear your mind. It's time for some clarity here. What's that? Is that a museum? All right, we're going to the museum. It's one of our little aspirations. We're gonna do that. I just like want. Oh, you came in your swimsuit. All right, so we're going. We're going to the museum. Let Let's go inside, shall we? Is there anything upstairs? Let's play some piano. Let you know we're here on our own in our swimsuit. She looks better when she's dressed, doesn't she? <laughs> it's got a problem with getting dressed. We come to the museum to play the piano. Who the hell's that? That's not Bella, is it? They better not be. It is! What's she doing here? 
There's no way she's coming into the museum. Okay. Oh, you've had enough of the piano, I guess? Wait, wait, chat with Bella. Is the game forcing this to happen? Is the game making this happen? <laughs> oh dear. See, see, she's gone over there to talk to her as she's passing by. And she's kind of being a little bit rejectful, isn't she? She's quite pushy. Big boobs, isn't she? Go, oh yeah, go, go back to looking at paintings and let her go wherever it is she's going. I think she feels a little bit uncomfortable. Doesn't she? I think you need to go home. Oh no, she's coming to the museum. What's she doing? Big boobs, you need to stop! <laughs> You're in the bathroom of a museum. Like, there's too many coincidences happening here. I think it's time that we went home, don't you? Big boobs! Right, you're home, okay? Now go, let's go to sleep, because you need it. I think we should ask Thingy to come round. Because I think that, you know... He'll be right over. Alright, go greet your boyfriends. Big boobs. I know we're taking it slow and playing the fit. Oh no, he does not look happy. Oh shit. Does he know what she's been doing? For a baby. What is the matter with you? He's going into sleep. Oh my god, he's depressed, isn't he? Wow. Oh dear. Alright. Let's Brit let's let's get this all out in the open. I can't bear this any longer. Let's invite Bella around as well. The way she's walking all cocky. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. They're both in the same house. Her new love interest, apparently, and Thingy are in the same house, and I don't know what is going to happen. Are they gonna, like, kill each other? Is he gonna leave big boobs? <laughs> what am I doing? I don't know. I just don't know.